SpinLaunch, a startup founded in 2018 with the goal of putting satellites into orbit. Using a giant slingshot has abruptly shut down. According to reports from its former employees, the company ceased operations in early March, three months after successfully completing an over $1 million fundraising round. So what exactly happened to the company and why is it no longer around? In today's episode, we are answering the question, what exactly happened to Spin Launch and the Orbital Accelerator? Never again. Before we begin, this is the channel that takes you one step further every day. If you're new here, make sure to subscribe for updates. Let's get started. So first off, what was Spin Launch and what was the Orbital Accelerator? Spin Launch was a space technology startup based in Long Beach, California that developed a unique method of delivering satellites to orbit using a device they called the Orbital Accelerator. Instead of relying on rockets, Spin Launch S system consisted of a giant catapult-like device that would launch a rocket sled along a one-mile-long track at speeds reaching up to Mach 10. At the end of the track, the rocket sled would release a rocket which would then fire up and propel itself into orbit. This approach eliminated the need for a rocket engine during the initial launch phase, reducing both the cost and environmental impact of space travel. The idea behind Spin Launch was developed by aerospace engineer and CEO of Spin Launch, Alex Guberman. After graduating from the University of California, Santa Barbara in 2014, Guberman and his team spent several years refining their concept and building prototypes. Their hard work paid off in May 2021, when Spin Launch successfully completed a test launch of their system in the New Mexico desert. During the test, their device accelerated a rocket sled to nearly Mach 6, releasing a suborbital rocket that reached an altitude of 120 kilometers. Following this success, Spin Launch raised over $1 million in seed funding in late 2021. With the investment, the company planned to scale up their operations and conduct more test launches, including one from their newly acquired Spaceport America site. However, these plans were abruptly halted in March 2022 when the company laid off its entire staff and shut down operations. According to a report from the information, Spin Launch had been struggling financially for some time and was unable to secure additional funding despite their successful test launch. The company had also faced regulatory challenges related to their use of explosives during their launch tests. These factors may have contributed to the decision to shut down. But wait, there's more. There's also this story from the mothership. Apparently, Spin Launch was not the only space startup working on a unique method of launching spacecraft that recently shut down. Mothership, a startup founded in 2016 with the goal of developing a reusable launch system using a giant swing arm, also ceased operations in early 2022. Like Spin Launch, the company had previously raised significant funding securing over $30 million from investors like Airbus, Safran, and the European Space Agency. Mothership S technology consisted of a large swing arm that would be used to accelerate a rocket to orbital speeds. Once the rocket reached the desired speed, it would release a spacecraft, which would then continue on to orbit independently. Mothership completed several test launches of their system in the years leading up to their shutdown but they were never able to achieve the necessary speed and altitude to reach orbit. The exact reasons for Mothership's demise are unclear, but it's possible that the company's technology was simply too ambitious and they were unable to secure the funding necessary to continue development. It's also worth noting that both Mothership and Spin Launch were based in California, which has been a hotbed for space startups in recent years. However, the state's high cost of living and doing business may have made it difficult for these companies to compete with more established players in the industry. Both Spin Launch and Mothership represent the bold and innovative nature of the space industry. While their systems were ultimately unable to achieve their goals, their efforts have likely inspired other aspiring space entrepreneurs to push the boundaries of what's possible. Only time will tell what new and innovative methods will be developed to explore the final frontier. That's all for today's episode. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe so you don't miss out on future episodes. If you have any thoughts or suggestions, feel free to drop them in the comments below. We'll see you next time.